live from Wildland Farm. Yes. Lauren Dahl. Believe it or not, this is not the first time. We filmed our very first um, goat milk soap adventure and that will never see the light of day. No, it was fabulous. We are making lemon meringue goat milk soap. Okay, so what you got here? Okay, so I have my lye and goat milk solution and the goat milk was in ice cubes and we just add the lye and slowly melt the ice cubes. It's about 75 degrees and this is the oils. And it's coconut, palm, olive, castor, sweet almond, and sodium lactate. I am just going to gently fold it in. Ooh, it's chunky. I'll have to stick blend those chunks out. Yes, our goat milk is very high in fat. So the and lye starts saponifying. With the goat milk just all fat. on its own. Yeah. So we strained this too so that it breaks up the clumps, but also will catch any big lye particles. Just as a safety for precaution, safety measure. Mm -hmm. And now we're gonna mix it. You wanna get like maybe an overhead. And that's probably good for right now. Then we're gonna add our fragrance oil. What are we using today? We're using lemon sugar from Nature's Garden. Get every last a drop. So I'm gonna check trace and it's at a very thin trace. That just means how thick the batter is. You can see it just comes off in little droplets. We're looking for more of a stream. <laughs> so I think we'll try to get to that once we've separated them. So we are doing a yellow bottom with some white on top for the meringue. So I'm going to um, just eyeball out enough for the top. Probably about that much. Sure. Maybe tight. Are you gonna swirl any white in there, or just? I don't think so. Okay. I think it's just gonna be yellow. I think it's gonna be just very simple. Yeah, that's more than enough. Then. Okay, and this is our yellow mica that's been dispersed in some oil. You get that from Brambleberry. Yes, this is just yellow mica from Brambleberry. I didn't even use the full amount. Is it that yellow after the cure? It shouldn't be. It should be a lighter yellow. Yeah. Why is that funny? Because you're curing it. Oh, yeah. Okay, gotcha. It's sick. Okay, well, that's just gonna sit for a second. Then, this is titanium dioxide. Dispersed in water? Dispersed in um, distilled, water. distilled water. There's a marble in there to break it up. Oh, I just got it all over me. <laughs> it's okay. This is skin safe, so even if I wasn't wearing gloves, which I always will be, because be we're fine. dealing with caustic chemicals. I'm gonna start with three, and I'm gonna take my whiskey poo. Ding ding. We're gonna mix it up, so that's not even half mixed. So I can kind of look at it from the side. Yeah, that's not, I'm going to pour in more. I just measure it so that way when I'm redoing this, I know how much I put in. Okay. Oh no. So this is a tall, skinny um, 
slab mold and it will make three tall skinny loaves. And it's from Heritage Workshop. And we love it. Yes, we do. That looks like lemon meringue. Well, good. That's what the soap yes. is called. I now need to make a lemon meringue pie and eat it. I know. It's beautiful. I'm going to scrape out this container later. So I wish you could smell this. It smells like lemon meringue. So we have to let that set up a little. Yeah, and this is still, let's see if I can get it. How well can you see? I see perfectly. Okay. You see how it's kind of keeping it stream and making lines on top? That is like a super light trace. What are you aiming for, a medium trace? I think I want it to be, well, this can be light. I just want this to be. Like that even looks like meringue filling. <laughs> So that's just, if there's any air trapped down in there, that will we'll release them. Release the bubbles. But release don't do it so hard that the soap the then bubbles. pops back up into your face. Yeah, that's bad. I've never done that though. No, I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, we're yeah, just gonna wait a second. And I'm gonna try it on this corner. So Lauren is breaking the fall with the spatula. Very successful. And now we really let it sit because I want to peek it just a tiny bit. Make and it right now it's very, yeah. <laughs> right now it's very liquidy. So I'll be back in hopefully five minutes. <laughs> Visualization. You have to imagine the loaves it's going to be split into. Something I'm very, very, very good at. We're going for soft. Pe oh, should I, am I just peeking it all over all right. or am I peeking it into a line? I thought we were just gonna peek it to look like meringue. Okay, fine. We're just randomly peeking. How's that look? Beautiful. All right, sure figure out. Oh, sugar eating. Mm -mm -mm. You put that over there just so it doesn't get on the table. Beautiful. Yeah, but okay, I think that was I'm gonna enough. use the other hand. Oy. I spilled some salt, that's what that noise was. I'm not a cartoon. Oh, you can't even hardly see this. Yeah, I wouldn't put too much on that. And then sparkle it. Sparkle. Silver sparkles or gold? I think silver. I think straight silver. Comment, did we make the right choice? Straight silver. Oh yeah, I mean, not crazy sparkle. It's a pie for goodness sake. How's that? I think it so needs another pass of sparkle. Okay, beautiful. Join us tomorrow for cutting. <laughs> Welcome to tomorrow. <laughs> We're now going to cut our lemon meringue soap. First, we have to get it out of the slab mold. Ooh, hoo, hoo. And then I just 
take it like this. Yeah. Oh, let's put it on the good idea. With its little friends. It's its little friends. It's very yellow. I like that color. I'm just gonna set that there. Now we have our loaf splitter. Voila. Voila. Oh, it, it boogered up the corner on that side. That's okay. Now we just manhandle it on over. Then we just... Did you get it tight enough? I think so. We'll know for in a second. Yeah. Oh, it's going through like butter. Okay. They're very stuck together. Can you pick up the top? Can I pick up the top? The answer is no. Oh, look at that discoloration we've got going on. Hmm. That is interesting. Interesting. I hope that that all discolors to this bright Beautiful yellow. yellow. One. Yeah, do you remember when I was pouring the white and it broke through mm -hmm. on one side? Oh, it That's really did. Must have been what happened there. It looks a little bit like a pear. Mm -hmm. Think you could do it again? No, probably not. This one we're calling kooky lemon meringue. Mm -hmm. I like the acrylic because you can just wash it off, but while I'm using it, it looks really um, smudgy is the word I'm choosing. This yellow is so fun. I really like it. Mm -hmm. 